billions of years of evolutionary advancement. And then we have Cassie. Happy day, I am Gloom! And today I am playing another virtual reality game. It's supposed to be a very immersive experience, which I am particularly fond of. It is called Blocked In. I don't know much about it, so let's just get right into it. We are here, guys, and it looks like I can kind of put my head in it. <gasps> Ooh, okay. Now let's go over here. Again, I can put my head in it. It looks like a nice little uh, office. Much more organized than I'm used to. Let's enter. Oh! It's like the bigger version of what I just saw. That's cool. Wow. Someone's been doing some finger painting. That's cool. Okay guys, this is what I think is happening right now. It's raining Tetris pieces because Tetris is taking over the world and I'm filming a video through this camera that's right in front of me trying to tell you what's going on. This Tetris piece, I'm, I guess I'm trying to take it apart so I can see what it's all about. What is taking over the world? It's like War of the Worlds and this is what I have. I mean, it's not an interesting alien or anything. It's just kind of a Tetris piece that's made of smaller Tetris pieces. I've got a pile of Tetris over here, pile of Tetris over here, pile of Tetris over there, except I use that one as a stool, so it's kind of my friend. Got Tetris on the news, Tetris on the radio, Tetris everywhere. I got a saw over here, which I was probably sawing this motherfucker with, but there's nothing I can personally do. I just feel so helpless and sad. Okay guys, so I'm just gonna sit here in this room for about five minutes and see what there is to see and how much I can immerse myself in this experience and see what I can take out of it, because I feel like that is the point of this entire exercise. It's 1984 in Russia, and I guess this is the day where it happened, but everything is just kind of leaking down, and oh my god, I, I kind of want to give up, just like those curtains gave up in being pretty. I mean, they're right on the radiator, isn't that a fire hazard or something? And why am I recording myself? I mean, no one's gonna be watching this. How the fuck did I get over here? It appears that virtual reality kind of repositions itself, so I thought that I was looking at you guys that whole time, but I was looking way over there and talking to nobody. I really enjoyed this experience just because it is exactly what it is. I mean, it's kind of cool to play a game where nobody really tells you anything and there isn't really anything to do. You just kind of have to sit there and figure it out for yourself. The music made it seem so sad and lonely and like something was wrong and that you were trying to figure out what happened but you can't do anything. Just that feeling of helplessness was very, I guess, disorienting and it made me feel very distraught. But I'm happy to not be in that situation and to be here right now. If you like this video, please give it one of these and make sure to give that gloomy subscribe button a little pick me up, but only if you like it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll talk to you very soon. Bye. <laughs>